instant photography has its own charm and we must agree that the pictures pack in so much character. One company that's dedicated on a mission to bring instant cameras back in style is Fujifilm. And the latest to join its product portfolio is the Instax Square SQ6, which is the company's first analog square format camera. In terms of ergonomics, the Instax Square SQ packs in no frills and is pretty straightforward. In fact, the hardware looks very similar to Instagram's logo. Inside the box, you will get the SQ6, three colored flash filters to give you an Instagram-like filter effect in real life, an attachable strap and two non-rechargeable batteries, which is a dampener for me. I know Fujifilm wants to take its user down memory lane, but the company should have packed in at least a USB charging option on this one. Taking the nostalgia trip a step further, the Square SQ6 does not pack in an LCD screen. However, I'm sure photography purists will appreciate this and rely on the good old viewfinder. In terms of functionality, it packs in shooting modes like double exposure, macro mode, landscape mode and even selfie mode. For this, the company has shown in a tiny mirror on the front of the camera. While playing around with different modes, I realized that not all images turn out the way you anticipate and you have to learn on the go. Sometimes you may end up with shots like this one. Trust me, I saw something completely different in the viewfinder. Oh, I know they call it instant camera, but keep in mind that it takes approximately 90 seconds for the film to develop and I personally love the uncertainty factor. Overall, at 9,999 rupees, the Fujifilm SQ6 aims to target those who are either bored of their smartphone photos or are absolute beginners to instant photography and are looking for an easy-to-use gadget, basically just to have fun. Keep in mind that a pack of 10 films will set you back by another 700 rupees. So if you see value in this entire package, then the SQ6 makes for a decent buy. That's it in this edition of CNBC TV 18 Set Toys. I'll see you next time.